Good day, good day. <laughs> Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dano. And how are you doing today? Yeah, we got a one-up Wednesday and uh, we're going to unbox it too. <laughs> All right, where do we get this one from? NC. Uh, that's North Carolina. North, North Carolina. North. Or, or as we say up south here, <laughs> north. North. Uh, Holly Springs, North Carolina. Okay, this is going to be a great one. And uh, you guys need to stick around because you know what? Uh, because of this uh, number right here, I know exactly what this is. I uh, bought it off eBay. I didn't have one. I don't have one. For real, as far as I know, I don't have one of these. And I need your help. I need your help. That's right. Just uh, got it in the mail. Um, let's see. I paid $18.61 for it on eBay, all right? Uh, I hope this is everything that I think it should be or hope it to be, all right? All right. Are you guys ready for this? Ba-bam! Oh, that's not it. <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. It's in the package. It's in the package, ladies and gentlemen. Now we got a problem. <laughs> we, I was going to... I thought it was loose. I thought it was a loose piece, and I thought we could really take a look at it. But it's in the package, and it's the one of, of it that I have. This is the Land Rover, and Land Rover logo are trademarks owned by and licensed by Jaguar Land Rover Limited. Do you know what this is? Do you recognize this? Let's take a look around the package here. Now, if you don't know, this is a 143rd scale. I, I get that. I get that 143rd scale. I don't get any of the rest of that. Hopefully, one of you guys across the pond over there can uh, decipher what that means. We do understand this. Land Rover 2. Uh, I don't know what that means because this is a Series 1. Oh man, the picture on eBay it was it was a loose product which don't get me wrong, I'm happy it's in the package. This is totally awesome. This means that it's mint, but I can't I can't look at it. I can't <laughs> I can't touch it. Oh yes. Unbelievable. Here we go. This is going to tell us a little bit more right here. The importer. Yes. D Agosti D Agosti Costini D Agostini Poliski Yes and I did a little um research on D Agosti Dini D Agostini my I'm sorry my Polish Warsaw Polish is uh, horrible but uh, this is a, a model for collectors, not suitable for children under 14 years old. Made in PRCH. I'm not really sure where that is, and I'm not going to try to pronounce this here name here. Holy cow. Well, anyway, if you don't know, the um, I guess the accredited toy maker that the seller was this... D. Agostoni, uh, which is a Polish Warsaw company, um, they kind of told me that it was a IST uh, made in Macau, but yeah, I'm not really sure. Uh, <laughs> wow, look at look at the details on this bugger. Uh, lens lens inserts on there even even the indicators are uh, lens indicators what does that license plate say IA175 tree IA175 tree beautiful this is beautiful bronze green 
It has uh, individual wipers on it. I like the bubbles on the corners here to protect the uh, mirrors on the wing. Nice cr uh, chrome um, rims on it. Not really per se something that Land Rover would done. But uh, it's got the trim piece, the galvanized trim piece on the door. It is a um, left hooker. So that is attractive for us uh, left hooker drivers. <laughs> Painted door handle in there. That is really nice. I don't know if you can quite see it, but it does have leaf springs in there. I'm trying to show you. Man, I really thought I was going to be able to really show you a nifty model here in the, in the, in the, out of the package. I said, should say, I was going to say in the nude, but out of the package. Very, very nice. Yes, those uh, tail lights and turn lights are uh, insert plastic there. Very, very nice. It almost looks. There's a consistent crack, uh, you know, where the top goes to the, the body and it goes right up the windshield here. And as you can see on the front there, you know, you can see where the two parts meet together. I just wonder if that piece, uh, and you can see how that back here, you can see the line there where that's two pieces and uh, you know, knowing a little bit about manufacturing, you, you know, this this is not that heavy, but I believe the body is die cast. Oh, a nice little touch there. That is a separate little piece for the uh, gas cap. That is a little black separate piece. Got the little tail pipe there. You can see the grab handles on it. Wow, this is so nice. I paid uh, $18, $18.61. Awesome, awesome little model. Um, yeah, the, now, uh, D'Agosti, Gostini, uh, go to their website. You can learn more about them. Uh, but the D, it's a D'Agostini is the, the company. But you can go there and you can learn a little bit about them. They do produce, uh, they, they were... Uh, a publishing house back 1901 but they do do promotional stuff I know they're big into Iron Man right now they've got some stuff and some other cartoon Pokemon Yoji Ho stuff that I'm not familiar with here over across the pond but uh, boy that is just a gem oh I uh, more than what I would uh, normally pay uh, but this Ladies and gentlemen, is a very nice model, 143rd scale, so very good size to it. And uh, yeah, in the package, I I did not realize that it was in the package. It, the pictures on uh, eBay were um, out of the package and uh, very very nice. Let's flip this around so you can have it in centimeters too. But uh, yeah, very. Very, 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 very nice. I, I love this. This is a beautiful model. It's going to be a nice collection, uh, addition to my collection. And uh, just, just really cool. I really like it. Um, one of my goals here at Roverland, and uh, here I'm just going to give you the big old Roverland. How <laughs> the honk are you? Uh, one of my goals in life, my my mission in life, is to have a model of every toy manufacturer uh, that produced a, a Land Rover. So, like this one, um, and as far as I know, is produced by Dian uh, Diagostoni. Uh, so this would be, uh, I would check that off the list, this, this manufacturer. Uh, now, uh, because I, I want a Land Rover model from every toy manufacturer that made a Land Rover. So uh, that, that's, that's my bucket list. That's what I'm doing here, folks. This is what I'm trying to do. And uh, someday maybe I'll get there. Uh, 
the Guinness Book of World Records of having a, a Land Rover from every toy manufacturer around the world. And um, yeah. So anyway, do you have one of these? Do you, do, do you own one? Do you have loose ones? Comment down below uh, if you know any more about this company. Uh, come on over to Facebook. I don't know why I point over there, but come over to Facebook and uh, show me your pictures of yours. Uh, different colors, different um, series trucks, uh, hard top, canvas top. What what do you know of this D'Angelo St uh, Stoney? I can't even pronounce it. I'm I'm horrible at this. D'Agostoni um, company. Do you know about this? Uh, are they from Italy? Are they from? Uh, uh, I, I think they do a lot with the Corgi or Dinky. Do they buy out the Dinky company? But anyway, there you go. That's it for a one on Wednesday. <laughs> I gotta go. Look, I gotta look at this closer. I'm gonna call it a video. Thank you for joining me with the one on Wednesday. What a crazy car. <laughs> Come on over to Facebook, Roverland. Instagram at Roverland Channel. And uh, give me a thumbs up, share, subscribe, tell your friends, and, and let me know what in the world is going on with this model, all right? I, I love to find out more. All right, I'm out of here. Thank you very much for joining me today. As always, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover day.